Hey guys, welcome to Big Joe Malia's World. And welcome to the Fuego Spice Company Choco Challenge. White Lightning. Big Joe is going to do a chocolate, a hot chocolate challenge. And what this challenge is, is the um, Fuego Box. White Lightning. White Lightning Challenge. Chocolate and Challenge. What this is, is every box that is purchased through FuegoBox.com, they donate 50 meals to a local food bank. So that's, it's it's a good thing. It's a good charity. It um, is. Anytime you're donating to... Feed the hungry. That is always a good um, a good thing. So we purchased this box through FuegoBox.com. Some of you may be familiar with Fuego Box. They do have hot sauces and they have monthly uh, subscriptions and things like that that you can Some do. Good sauces. They really do. They have you know not everything they have is just terribly hot though. No, have, no, it's not yeah, terribly hot. They sauces. have lots of mild things. They have lots of like barbecue type. Sauces yeah, and things like that. They even got a hot honey and they yeah, got a hot sauce. Um, it's not and, just all you know. It's all it's not yeah, just all incredibly no. hot challenge kind of things. But one of their subscription boxes is called mild to hot, mild to wild or something oh, okay. like that. It's mild to hot. But this is, is the Choco challenge. challenge. And what what Big Joe? Y'all know y'all already know. Lee is not participating no. in this. Nah, nah, and not going to do it. Anyway, so. What Big Joe has to do in this challenge is there is a little bar of chocolate in this box. That's that's it. That's the chocolate. That's all it is, okay? And it says... And look, it's got like... It's the Fuego logo. Like a Grim Reaper on it. Oh, do it? Is it upside down? No. There. Okay. No, it's upside down. See? Yeah, I see. Okay, yeah. There, it like says, that. See? It's a hot guy. Last chance to turn back. <laughs> you must be insane. So, first thing he has to do, he has to eat it. Okay? He has to attempt to eat the entire bar of chocolate and film it. This is what we're doing. Filming this. Um, take a video or photo of yourself trying to eat it. Terrible, sweet, pain awaits. Yep. Then we got to share it. We have to post this on social media. I will post this on our Instagram and our Facebook. Uh, Facebook page as well as YouTube. And we are going to, if you post it on your social media, you stand a chance to win a year of hot sauce from the Fuego Spice Company, a.k.a. FuegoBox.com. Which would be nice. Yes. Be sure and tag at FuegoBox and hashtag Choco Challenge 2020. And five friends who should take the challenge. So we will finish this challenge and then we will tell you who Big Joe wants to tag to complete this challenge as well. So, a little bit about the bar. This bar of chocolate is white chocolate and it has a blend of 12 peppers in it. Mm -hmm. And it was created by Ed Curry of Pucker Butt Pepper Company. Pucker Butt Pepper Company. It's one of the That's biggest. That's just fun to say. It's one of the biggest pepper companies in the world. That's just fun to yeah, say. Pucker Butt, Pucker pepper, butt company. pepper Company. Yes. But one little bar of chocolate. You must be insane to consume, consume this, pain. this pain. So this is just a cool little box. How much was this, hey? 20 bucks. 20 bucks. Like I said, it by spending this 20 bucks at Fuego Box. We actually donated enough money to um, feed, feed 50, 50 meals, meals. 50 yeah. meals for the homeless. So it was a good, good charity. It's a good cause, guys. It is a good cause. It's good, a good cause. Uh, you know. Um, That's one thing it, that really drawn me to it is. Yeah, it, it is. It is. Feeding America is the is the charity, and you know, 
Doing something dumb and doing something good at the same time. Doing something dumb and doing something good at the same time. Now, with this challenge, he only has to consume it. There's no waiting period. He doesn't have to hold it in his mouth. He doesn't have to. But I'm going to try to wait it out. He's going to try you to. You know me. I'm not He's going to try to I wait. I got my big old Dollywood he cup He got his milk. Dollywood cup of milk ready. But He's ready to go. I'm going to hold off. And try to endure it. Y'all, I'm just here for spousal support. Of course, I'm not God. participating in this challenge. It's not even look like chocolate. It does It's not even white. You no, can see it's the like peppers. A, yeah, it's like a red. Now, one good thing about this is there's not a lot of capsation in there. What capsation is, is the... Well, it's not extract. It's not uh, extract. Yeah, that's yeah, what capsation is. It's just pure peppers. So it... I got a little nibble on my tongue. It may not have as much after effect as if it had the extracts in well, that's it. Hot. So, yeah. So, that's hot. without further ado, let's do this. I'm going to break it. I just pop it on your mouth at the same time. Yeah, but I'm afraid. I, I'm going to put it all in my mouth, but I don't want to. Like, if you're eating a saltine hole. Yeah. Okay. Don't put it on your lips. It. It's not like that. Okay. There's no oil, oil in it. No, there's no oil in it. It's all peppers. Okay. Does it taste good? Does it taste like chocolate? It tastes like chocolate. Is it sweet? Mm -hmm. Like a sweet? I'm not doing it. <laughs> there's no way I'm doing that. Mm. Is it tasty though? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. It's hot. I bet. Mm. It's. De Have you got it all in there already? Oh, yeah. Oh, he's already ate it all. Mm. Does it taste good, though? For the most part. <laughs> You've had worse, I guess. You've had better, but he's had worse. I'm going to fan him. I don't see any beads of sweat popping up yet. It's hot, folks. Hot. Down the hatch. He did it. He That's did hot. it. <clears throat> there goes the back of the throat. It's a little spicy, isn't it? So what kind of peppers are in this? Let me just read. I'll read You'll to you. You'll have to read. Cause I will. We have... Um, there goes the hiccups. <laughs> Excuse goodness. me, guys. Of course, there's all kinds of reapers. Uh, fluorescent mustard scorpion. Pepper Y with a question mark. Um... I don't know. I can't even read any. Of, I, I can't even pronounce a lot of these words. They're just weird. Uh, the razor, chocolate, brut, brutla. Do not eat if you have any allergies to spicy foods. Nightshades or capsation. Ingredients, sugar, you know, blah, blah, blah. There's lots of. Do not consume if you're pregnant, breastfeeding, or have a medical condition. We take no responsibility for your crazy choice to eat this. <laughs> You're on your own. If you accept this challenge, you are completely on your own. So what do you think? You did Man, it. It's hot. Is it the hottest thing you've had so far? I'll be honest. It's between this and that sauce, the end. Oh yeah? That we did at your sister's house. Yeah, at Michael Jordan had. Michael Jordan's got a bottle. Mm -hmm. It's called the end. Honestly, I'm He's not had any milk yet. The worst so problem was the So I'm kind of surprised hiccups. by that. But I think the hiccups is gone. Yeah, the hiccups are just a uh, it's reaction. Hot. I ain't gonna lie to you. It's hot. a reaction. Oh, yeah. It's hot. But you, I can't believe you've not had any milk or anything. I'm kind of proud of that. You know, guys, eating spicy foods if you have Nose um, running. if you have like a high blood pressure or something like that it actually is good for your body to consume hot foods i've researched um, kind of helps you sweat your some of your medical condition out i've researched and i've researched will eating hot stuff kill you or affect your health or affect your health everything i've read it says that for the most part runny nose Yes. Sweats. The sweat. Sweat's good for you. Can cause shortness of breath. But that's cut if you but panic. But that's usually to the panic. If you remain calm, you should for not the most get part, the most part. <laughs> <laughs> you should not get the um, shortness of breath if you remain calm and try not to panic. I would panic. I'd be all over the place. I'd be outside. And it said, it actually said, 
it was a college professor who said that that said it will it is good for your sinuses it even helps you get rid of headaches and something else that's interesting i mean it really is oh it curb it'll curb your appetite and help you lose weight oh wow that's neat that's neat so Take it, you a drink honey no you're not gonna do it no my daddy didn't raise no poop <laughs> I would already, it. I would have already dove in that milk glass, y'all. Ain't no doubt. No, I'm a, I'm a chili head guy. No, he is. Totally. I don't, don't let it fool you. <laughs> don't let it fool you. I've eaten a lot of hot stuff in my time. That's hot. That's that's up there. I'm doing good now. It's some siding. All right, who are we going to challenge for this Choco Challenge 2020? You want me to read them? I'm really not sweating. No, just a, just a barely, just a little bit. Yes, Not I'm bad at all. Beast, I'm a beast. He's a king around here. King around here. <laughs> I'm a man. <laughs> He's a king around here. It's hot. It's hot, and and surprisingly, the gut's fine so far. Good. The. Good. I told him before we started you know, this. I'm like, I do not want this to ruin our weekend. When you eat Please. hot stuff. It can kill your gut. They're yeah. like, like some people like get excruciating cramps. Yeah. I mean, I don't. I, yeah. I have not experienced excruciating. Gut steel. Now, tomorrow at the party, uh, <laughs> in the words of old Johnny Cash, ring of fire. <laughs> All right, guys. So we have Joe has chosen his five folks that he wants to. Challenge for this challenge, and they are who? First of all, because I've seen this man eat the Reaper Belt jelly beans, and he eats Tabasco on everything. I think he would eat Tabasco on ice cream. The Ford man. The Kenneth Ford Oaks. man. Kenneth Oaks. <laughs> I want to see you do this, buddy. I think you would do it. I think you could do it. I'm pretty sure. Now, this next one, I just like the guy a lot. I I think he could hang. I, I think, think he, he could. Can hang. He's a tough. He's a tough boy. That's Tyler Sidwell of Sidwell, Sidwell Universe. Universe. Oh, Tyler. You know, we're fans of the Sidwells. Y'all, everybody knows that. We tag them in a lot of things. Yes. But they're always good sports. Always. The next one is Michael Howe, the Wandering Wood Whisperer. Oh, Michael Howe. I know he could do it. I want to see Michael Howe do it. I believe he can hang. He's a pretty he tough it. old bird, too. He is. That's a fact. Now, this next guy is a chili head. Oh, yeah. Big D, Big Daniel D. Hoffman. Daniel Hoffman. Big D, because he's done some challenges. Mm -hmm. I want to see Big D do it. Now, this next one, this is my partner. He's close to our heart, boy. This is my partner in crime when it comes to hot challenges. <laughs> I am challenging you, Otis. Otis, Otis Sloan, Sloan, the Kentucky, Kentucky coal miner. You can do it, buddy. I think he can. Now, I think I, they I all know can. He can. I think we they did, all can. Me and Otis did <laughs> the end sauce together. Yep. And he stuck it out. You did the out. jelly bean contest together. Bean together. I know he can I do it. I believe he can do it. You but got guys, it. we'll include all the links to all these YouTube channels in the description of this vlog. Also, we will include all the links so you can get your very own Fuego Box Choco Challenge 2020. Supports a good cause. Feeding America. You did it. It's good. High five, babe. High five. He did it. He's what the king two, around here. What has two thumbs and just did the Choco Challenge and ruled that baby? This, this guy. guy. Guys, thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed it as much as Big Joe did. I loved it. That was good. It Honestly, was, he did it. Tasted good. His <laughs> white chocolate with a little kick. If you try this challenge, please let us know. In yes. the comments, or if you've tried any challenge like this, we'd love to hear about it. We really would, guys. Yeah. And as always, thank you for allowing a little bit of Big Joe Malia's world into your world. We'll see you soon, guys. Bye.